Hello, welcome to SS Unitech Susil this side and today we are going to see about the take, first, tail, head and limit functions inside the PySpark. So let me quickly go inside the browser and we'll try to see in practical. So here I am going to create one of the data frame and in this data frame it will be having two columns with the first name and is. Now here as I told you we need to check the take function first. So df dot here we can use the take and inside the take we need to specify the numbers like from top how many rows we want. So let me assume I want total three rows. So let me use the display of this and as we are taking only three rows from the top so James N and Michael will be the output of this take three so that we can see James N and Michael so take will be going to return the value from the top always now second we have head so head is synonym of take so it will be also returning the same thing it is also picking the values from the top and returning how many rows we are specifying under the parameter of head now next will be first so what first will do first will be going to return always top one so it will be returning only James that you can see here so first is going to return the value of row like this now next we have tail so tail will also do the same thing it is also picking how many rows we want so let me assume I want total four rows but tail will be picking from the bottom so it will be having total four rows till Michael so let me execute and we'll see the output of this so that we can see from John to Michael it is turning total four rows from the bottom next let me use the limit so limit is also doing the same thing it will be picking total four rows from the top so that we can see James till Scott in this video we have seen about the take head and limit so these three will be doing the same thing and then we have seen about first so it is running the first value always and then we have seen about the tail so tail is reverse of head so I hope guys you have understood how we can use all these functions so thank you so much for watching this video see you in the next video